Let's have a little without dry eyes. You seem to have an unending supply of this stuff. Uh, let me tell you, it's getting harder and harder to find. I want to show you just a couple things to do with it. We have a, actually have a guide for all the viewers if they want to download our guide on all the cool things to do with the dry ice. It's fantastic. So HalloweenScience.com. HalloweenScience.com. Yep, absolutely. Oh, this so shows you the whole works, there. doesn't it? It's getting harder and harder to find. I can tell you if you're in the Denver metro area and go to a grocery store, try to find the dry ice. You have to go with a cooler. My suggestion, go with a cooler. Never put this in the freezer. It'll shut down the freezer because it tricks it. It's 110 degrees below zero. Oh. Always have your special glove. Watch what happens when we use regular uh, water. This is warm water. Very you drop it inside. Spooky. So you get that wonderful kind of little <laughs> bubbling. I'll show you what to do with that. This is a, a big uh, pot that people will sometimes put on their front porch. What you need to know with this is that water's going to cool down very, very quickly. Uh. So you just need to know that as much as you want to put in there, that's great. But you've got to replenish the water. So you got to dump the water out, put a hot water in again. If oh, you want that going all night long, it's not going to do it. It's going to get go cold for, uh, pretty that fast. Much dry ice will go all night long, at least. For, no, you know, no, well, four or five yeah, hours, you're going to have to get about 10, 15 pounds. Oh, general wow. air. If you're in the Denver metro area, uh, it's sometimes hard to find at the grocery stores. So general air is perfect. Look at this. Two things. See the water that's over here. I've got a black light on the water. If you dim the lights just a little bit, watch this. This is atomic glow. Oh, atomic glow. So, one of my favorite things. If you dim the lights and take a look at this right here, watch what happens when we shoot it in. Oh, yeah, very. Is that just amazing? And the last thing that you have to do is this. When the lights come back up again, you see the bubbling going on here. If you'll just take a small amount of dish soap, so now small amount of dish soap and just put a couple drops in there, you will keep the kids busy for hours. Look Ghost at this. bubbles. Go. Look at this. So now they can reach out and touch. I like this because now there's no fear of them getting close and touching the dry ice. Oh, it's see. contained with it. Because otherwise they want to put their face right down in You got there. it. Yeah. Problem is I can't get that to stop. So you're going to have to somehow do this <laughs> and then let that happen for a long, <laughs> long time. And the same thing happens here so when this goes down inside and you shoot a small amount of soap sitting inside there you just get bubbles that will take off forever Very I'm promising cool. you that's the party there right? they go this is the party the party in a bucket <laughs> Halloween on a budget party in a bucket we'll get it all to them and all the tips are there in the download at Halloween Science thank you, thank you Science Guy